All right, we're now in the field testing. Uh, I just set up the cable wire from this post to all the way down to that post. So it's around 40 meters in the lens. Now this one is hang in the middle. Now let's power it on the remote controller. All right, everything's good. As you can see, uh, it's almost get to the, the very right side. Now move it back. So from right now, you can see it's very stable. As we can see now, the system is just put on a regular sports cam. It doesn't have any gimbal on it. So uh, no stabilizer is the system. Hello everyone, today's DI project is about my version 2 cable cam. The frame is just a piece of aluminum. I just bend it into the frame. If you look at my first video, that's you know this arm is still from my drone's arm. Uh, it's made of carbon fiber and also uh, mm, this is a brushless motor with uh, the flying wheel attached to the, to the motor. And you can see uh, these two colors are different. One is a silver, one is a black. So this is the same color code of the drones. So this one will spin clockwise and this one will spin counterclockwise. So in the front is another piece of uh, aluminum attached to the bore mount. So the bore mount eventually will hook up to my uh, sports camera. This portion is the same as any of the action camera package you come with it. Let's deal with a little bit about the circuits. So the two brushless motor with the ESC and eventually will connect to the, the 3S lithium battery here. So when it's get connected, the 3S battery will also give the power to this Arduino Nano circuit board. And the signal to this one will be connected to one of the PWM ports and the signal to this one will also connect to another PWM port. And you can see at the back, attached to one of the arm of the cable cam, it's a FlySky X6B receiver. So the receiver right now I'm using the channel 4 to connect to one of the PWM ports coming to the nano boards. Basically, this is the, all the system how it looks like. The battery just put it here is to balance the action camera in front. So if I turn on my remote controller, as you can see the yawn because I connected to channel 4 and uh, define it. So if I go to this one, this flying wheel will spin. When I turn yawn left and this one will move counterclockwise and move to the left. And I also put an arm here. This is for the protection of this uh, cable cam flying off of the cable. Once the cable puts in, I will lock this pin here in case of this uh, cable cam fell off and will stop it from falling off. That's basically how this one works. It's like safety. So if you like my video, please give a, a thumb up or leave your uh, comment or subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your watching.